All new at 10 o'clock, some of the brightest students anywhere are sharing with us how they plan to change the world. Our Aaron Jones spent some time with the top scholars of the Regenerant Science Talent Search. They're high school seniors looking for more than straight A's or acceptance into a great college. Uh, through the Regeneron Science Talent Search, we're really just trying to create a project and uh, develop research to um, have a really huge impact on certain populations. Oh, it's definitely something anyone can do 100%. Um, you know, when you're in high school, you can start taking science courses as soon as your freshman year, your sophomore year, junior year. Amav Kambete says he was able to secure an internship through UT Southwestern, which has allowed him to research something that affects millions of Americans every day. My project specifically focuses on chronic pain, which can be caused by a, a variety of ailments. He explains commonly prescribed opioids like morphine or fentanyl can become addictive, so he's working on an alternative. Well, my project focuses on developing a new novel class of drugs, uh, which focuses on these key proteins in the, in the brain. Uh, which can inhibit chronic pain without uh, the addictive repercussions of opioids. Shreya Bhatt is studying antibiotic resistance. Essentially, as we produce these antibiotics, bacteria are obviously going to want to survive against them. She's trying to develop a sustaining and cost-effective solution. You develop an antibiotic that can last for centuries. And as for Neil Song, he's crafting a technology that recognizes sign language and transcribes it to text. He says, like Amazon's Alexa. Uh, my project really allows the sort of same types of benefits and conveniences to be afforded to those uh, who are maybe deaf or mute and can't really take advantage of speech recognition. As Regeneron Science Talent Search scholars, all three teens are being recognized for their ability to research and create innovative solutions to some of society's biggest challenges. I'm just really fortunate that my research is being recognized. Uh, for me, it's a big deal. It's kind of like a confirmation of my impact I can have on the world. I think like this work is kind of a start. They say above all else, this achievement validates their work, gives them exposure, and propels their journeys forward. In Dallas, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News.